Time for this sweet little game. That's what it is. It's such a sweet little game. All right, Bramble the Mountain King. A feel-good game of the year. I want to thank the devs for sending me a copy of this game. I think it's Dim Frost is the, the devs. Um, they provided the key for me to play the game for you. There's the, there's the warning that you need. Explicit violence, excessive blood, and gore. It also references topics... Oh, God, I didn't get to finish that. Okay. Trigger warning. Basically, trauma, bad stuff happens. You have been warned. All right, let's see. Are we going to get a, a happy ending from this game? Or is it going to leave us hollow inside? If you didn't watch yesterday and this game interests you, watch the VOD from yesterday or type hashtag gaming, snag a copy for yourself. It's really, it's really worth it. It's a good game. I'm impressed by this game. Disturbing as it is. Yeah. So let's finish this off today. <laughs> this is what we log into. <laughs> the kid is battered, bruised, bloodied, and he's just got that look in his eyes. He's crying. All right, where we go? What are we doing here? I forget. I just, I just tripped on a rat. All right, can I climb on this? Oh my, my little light doesn't work anymore. Hello? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Oh, okay. I tried that earlier. It wasn't working. Oh God, what is that? Oh, I am dead. Oh, he can't see me if I keep the light off? Okay. How do I sneak? Sneaky, 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 sneaky. Oh, God. Happy Tuesday. Ew, they are very gurgly. Can he kill me if I show him the light now? Play with your zombies. That's the lesson we've learned. Where's that sword now? I know, right? That was just for that. Hey, get out of the way, birds. So you tune in to certain points and you're like, oh, what a whimsical, fun little kid game. And then other times you're like, oh God, why would you play that? How many different ways did they program this little kid to die? <laughs> You're fine. A kind gesture. Somebody snagged something amazing from the Hummel store. Thank you, somebody. Humble or something. Humble store purchase made for $59.99. You're amazing. Thank you. If you want to share with the class what you got, that's cool. This game is beautiful and scary and amazing, and there's zero chance I would ever play it because I hate being chased. 
That was a big something. Uh, all right, so we need a sword, a pentagram, or a pentagon, and then, uh, I don't know, let's look at the shapes. What do we got? What kind of shapes do we got? We need that, yeah? We need that. That's for sure. Might need that. Let's put it on there. So that's the bot. That could be the bottom. Now we need a bigger, bigger, uh, cross. That might do it. We don't need triple dot. Will this do it? Is this everything? Yeah, that's everything. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. What's up? What's up? What's up? Break the mixture. Thank you, Mr. Rooster. Have you considered? Hey, it's Merm. Good. What's going on, Merm? How you doing? Um, eight dollars thirty-four cents to our next giveaway. Thanks, Rooster. Oh, we got another one. Um, square, triple dot, diamond, triangle. Somebody remember that? Square, triple dot, diamond. Square. Triangle. Triangle. Triple dot. I think that's everything. Nice. Okay, cool. And I didn't do that. It wasn't me. A kind gesture. That's somebody else on the humble store. Humble store well, purchase you. made for twenty nine dollars and ninety nine cents. Well, thank you, thank you. We know who got the other one? Oh, that was you. The final last. There are no more Spark Vault games. Oh, Sparkwood. Well, thank you once again for that amazing promotion. Um, I just I found another bug. Oh, you got you got Bramble, Nolan. Nice. I hope you enjoy it. I just found another bug. I jumped off the screen to the right there and I can't find my character anymore. This is the kind of game where messing around with the environment can lead to interesting things. Yeah, I broke out of the game yesterday. It was hilarious. Um, can I go up this way? Oh, you also purchase some Depends to wear while you play? That's a good idea. Oh, this might be the way I'm supposed to go, but let's let's look in here. Okay, it's locked. It locked. All right, it's locked. Yeah, may your wallet enjoy a well-earned rest. I agree. Yeah, you can just play on the toilet, that's right. 
Steam Deck. Okay, there's a symbol for a candle here. Um, key. Say keys to open doors. Shots do not hurt other players. Yet. Look at this camera. Look at this camera angle, man. This kid has seen some things. There's a corpse right there. I just walked on the corpse. him to do to say now that's what I told him to do crank that's true Anki He likes he likes sleeping under Reggie's bed. Like I don't understand why. It's dark and cool. Like I really thought for a second I'm like, oh my god, like this cat really loves Richie. Like he's finally showing it. No. He just does his little chirp meow up the stairs, just walks right past him. Come on, man. Can you doing, Buzz? No, my kids uh my kids spend half the time not here. And when they are here, they like demand like attention from the cat without like <laughs> providing anything fun for the cat like this they don't play with him they don't like give him treats or feed him or let him out or walk with him outside they literally just walk over want to pet him for a couple seconds and then move on and the cat's like no this i'm not gonna true. i'm not gonna like you but it's so cute when they do like when they are here and they see the cat and they're just like so fluffy i love him like they're just like really sweet because at their mom's house they have two cats but they're both short hair and they shed really bad. Like if you just pet them lightly, like your hand is covered in fur. So it's really different with Fizz. Oh, that's a body. Yeah. Okay. He drew a flower. Carved the flower. He carved a flower as he was dying. Okay, can I have the knife? You should pick up the knife, kid. Don't be silly. I want uh, a cookie or a couple of the pirouettes or maybe a bag of uh, tortilla chips. Yeah, but the bag of tortilla chips the size of my head. <laughs> no, I don't need anything, thanks. I, uh, honestly, I might just bring some with me when I go up. Because there you go. There's just... Russell says yes. Yes. <laughs> Rose Wolf, stand outside. I'm gonna throw the cookie in about 10 seconds. She's gonna throw it north to New York. All right? Yeah. Stand outside, the front yard. Oh, uh, okay, I can imagine.
You really want chips con queso now? Well, I bought shredded cheese so that if people do want it, I can just throw those chips in the oven with a little bit of shredded cheese on it. We have sour cream. Are you still full from last night? No. I... Oh. oh, okay. That was my fault. That was my fault. I woke up so sick this morning. I woke up, I was like, oh no. It was terrible. You're gonna pre guess Bogotter's lunch today? I bet it has tortilla chips in it. I was gonna make him nachos, but now I'm not Valaroka because you made me self conscious for a second. I'll have nachos. Uh, ooh. And grapes. Always grapes. There's no grapes, actually. The grocery store did not have any green grapes, and that's what I, pre I prefer buying the green grapes. But they did not have any. I. How do I gently go down the net? Okay, like that. There was, you go. That was fine. You'll have nachos. All right. Belroca, stand aside in your front yard and I'll throw them to you. I like this delivery method you've invented. Throwing? It's good. Okay, maybe we don't go here. Get back up there, kid. You made a mistake. Oh. There we go. There you go. Oh, uh, Dublin Ari. I have been enjoying uh, cucumbers with like feta cheese and I throw a little bit of Italian dressing on it and it's just, it's so stinking good. So like refreshing. Uh, no, Golomancy. It will not reach Sweden, but I will send it via Carrier Pigeon. <laughs> Uh, okay. Oh, this is, oh, this is dark. Oh, this is dark. Oh, it's like the twister again. If you let go of any of the buttons, they, there we go. Now I can take the key. Save keys to open doors. It's so dark. Yeah, it's kind of gross, right? Roger, roger. Let me Roger. Let me roger, roger. It. What is that thing we heard over here? I don't know. I gotta get out of here. I gotta go. Oh, I gotta go. Hiding. Have you seen that giant thing again? I've seen so many giant things. Really? Look at this. We've seen some shit. That's, oh my god, that's so <laughs> true. Holy shit. We have, we have seen some terrible, terrible things. Oh my god, I can't. Oh, Val Roca. Anything Alton Brown, I'll try it. Good Eats was literally like my life when it was on. It was so good. Oh no. I hate these books. Why? Dear diary. I am so in love with him. I cannot even describe it. It feels like he loves me too. Oh no. That's the flower the guy drew. This is not gonna go well. Our village still tries to heal its wounds from the dark days. But at least me and my love survived and have each other. After the horrible witch hunt, we thought we were safe. We thought we would have peace. But then the plague came to our village. It feels like the plague is some kind of punishment for our sins. Maybe we deserve this. People say they have seen an old woman with a rake at night. Every house she passes, people inside get sick. I hope she does not come to my house. I love how it starts with like, all right, it, the story turned bad with the plague, but then they have to one up it with the woman with the rake. <laughs> it's like plague not bad enough, caused by a woman who passes your house with a rake. Every morning, someone new has fallen ill and oh, shortly no. thereafter they die. We do not even dare to give them a proper funeral. It is horrible. 
The dead are rising from their graves, and they eat the ones left alive. I have locked myself in the house. I got separated from my love. Yeah, we found them already. I wish I could be with him. I hope I can meet him in the next life. Oh no. I'm out of food. Yeah. And the Why dead are right outside so my door. Every story, every book. It is, it is so dark. It either tells you about what's about to happen to you oh, no. or what you just went through. Oh no, oh no. I know. That's what this whole game is. It's just, let me tell you these terrible stories. Oh, no. So anytime you find a book, it's like, oh God. Valroca, I have not tried fruit. I've, I'll be honest with you. I've never had fruitcake in my entire life. So I have not tried his fruitcake or any fruitcake. Books are bad, okay. Yep, see? Just like Darkest Dungeon. Books are bad. I don't know, man. Lord of the Rings is pretty good, and that's a book. <laughs> and in Darkest Dungeon 2, we got killed by the librarian. Full, full party wipe. Serious? Oh, I still yes. haven't beaten that. Yes, 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 I remember. Oh, hi. Hi, guys. Dublin Ari, for some reason, reading... <laughs> Reading your message, I thought you swore for for a quick second. I don't know why. Fruitcake is good if done right. I'll have to try it sometime. Don't you soak it in a lot of liquor? She just said soak. I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm on. Okay. Don't you soak it? Um, this is where we were. How do we? Where do we go? Oh, over here. Okay. All right. Hi, guys. What does that mean? He forgot. Oh, I, I guess not. He did it. I like how that one gave up for a second. Okay. All right. It broke me. Wait, they just pick you up and that's it? Well, I don't know. That was the first time they caught me. Oh. These zombies are funny in this game, though, because they, uh, they easily give up. Do they? Me. Yeah, you can go like this and like... And they're like, nah, eh, whatever. That's me. Stop, that is so me. I love it. Isn't that funny as hell? You're not worth the trouble. These camera shots when they're like looking from a window, they're so creepy. And you're like, oh God, who's the creep in the window? And then you realize oh, I'm the creep in the window. back to the window. All right, whatever. I have to climb that. Screw that, zombie. Yeah. We're not climbing zombies. It always feels like somebody's watching me. And I've got no privacy. Oh. Um. Oh yeah, maybe I should use the light. Success is clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Really, I can't get in here because of that 
box. Did he fall in the hole? He did. <laughs> Except that's probably where I need to go. guys have worse perception scores than I do. Which I guess is good for us overall. Hi! It'd be really great if I could use my light in here. Spoopy, it is spoopy. This game has surprised me on many, many levels. Oh, this is where we were. Oh, dude, dude, dude. Chill. I'm going out here. Hmm, I don't know what we're supposed to do. What happens if I go down here? Oh, I walked right into him. And he just snapped me. And now he's eating me. Okay. Do we have to go in here? <laughs> okay. This time I'm going to try to fall down the first hole without making the zombie fall in the hole with me. Shall we try that? Oh, there's already a guy down here. But now there's one less guy. I can't tell if this is a, there's a zombie over here. What am I trying to get? Ah, that's a guy there. Okay, all right, what are we trying to get? What are we trying to do here? Oops. It's just the way out. Is this the house we didn't have to? Might be the house we didn't have to. Can I just go this way? Uncover the well and jump in it. Hmm. All right, we have to somehow get through this house. 